Hey, what's going on YouTube? What's going on YouTube? Back at Tony here. All right, we got the BMW. And um, first of all, I want to tell you guys, I do have the wideband set up and it's a gauge from Nick Performance Tuning. I know you can see that. Let me see if I can zoom in. NPT, that damn amp. Yeah, NPT. So I do have the AFR gauge and I do have a vortex sprocket. It is a 42. So before I go on in here, I did take off my seat and I do have a couple scuffles, which is a long story and I'll get into that. And I do have a seat delete, which I highly recommend. If you have two seats out there, I highly recommend this mod because what this mod actually does it actually makes you sit within the bike more and it just all around feels better you notice with this setup right here i have a uh, i have a vortex i have a vortex rear sprocket and it is a uh 44 tooth and with this setup I kind of maxed out a little early and I maxed out, I believe at 176, 178. And um, for the ninth, for the ninth, 10th, it was a little too early. And I wanted to, I wanted a little, I want a little more miles per hour. So I went ahead and got the aluminum sprocket red so it could match the, the kind of like the theme on the bike. And right now what I'm gonna go ahead and do, I'm gonna go ahead and set that up with the 42 teeth and um, I'm gonna go ahead and do a pull. So right now, the weather is kind of bad here, so I won't be able to do a pull now, but once the weather get better, I will do a pull. Right now, I am running the 93 Brent tuning. The 93 Brent tuning. I also have a fresh can of MR12, which I will be adding after I do my 93 pull so so you guys can check it out it is a fresh can haven't been haven't haven't been open still sealed i will be doing uh mr12 pull and see how the bike goes but for now what we're gonna do we're gonna upgrade the sprocket and from there we're gonna go back out to the ninth, 10th run and we're gonna see what we do so all right i just wanted to do a little update for you guys um I know I haven't been updating about this bike. So you see I have the wideband AFR gauge. Uh, I do have the the lowering, the, the straps. I did lower it uh, one and a half in the front. And I do have the, um, the I know you guys can see, the, the lowering links right here. So um, I still have one notch in the back that I could lower it but but if I try to lower that bike anymore it's pretty much gonna be dumped so me going down in tooth size I'll be able to pull that axle a little more back so we're gonna go ahead and get this done and you know I'll be back and show you guys you know the the ending results here the new 42 aluminum sprocket and I have here the the 44 steel i can tell you it's a big difference that weight i don't have a scale right now but the weight difference is big i can tell that bike is gonna move look at this just it weighs it weight nothing look at this one i could bear i could barely want to i could barely try to do that because it's heavier so both sprockets right here and we're gonna do a change we got the sprocket on for those who want to see it again right there 193a vortex aluminum sprocket and we're gonna give this setup a go and see how she runs and don't forget i will be running mr12 like i said it's a fresh can just purchased it last week so i will be running mr12 after I do my first run, um, first couple runs on 93 pump, I do have the Brent tuning and we'll see. I mean, this MR12 is so strong. 
like my whole patio backyard area smells like MR12. All right, there she is. For, your, for those who didn't know, I do have the, the AFR wideband and you know, running good. So we're gonna give this a try, the 42 in the back, see how I like it. And then we're gonna decide <clears throat> whether I wanna go back up in the front. Right now I'm 16 in the front, 42 in the back. I'll decide if I wanna go back up to 17 in the front and 42. But from friends and you know, a lot of people that have Beamers, BMWs, the S1008, 16 front. That's, it just hates it. So from all the people that told me S1000s hate 16 front. So I'm gonna give this setup a try and if I like it, I'll keep it. If I don't, I'll change it. Until then, see you later guys.